In this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Node.js in Google Colab. These are all the commands which you need to use and I will drop these commands in my blog and drop the link in video description so no need to copy paste or type these commands. Let me walk you through as how what exactly these commands are. The first one is simply the dpkg, a dpn based package manager and what it is doing is the configure option causes dpkg to finish configuration of partially installed packages and the dash a indicates that rather than a specific package all unpacked but unconfigured packages should be processed second statement is simply updating everything and then we are installing this some um, certificates curl to download and then gnupg package this gnupg allows you to encrypt and sign your data and communications it features a versatile key management system along with access modules for all kinds of public key directories gnupg it is also known as gpg is a command line tool or a cli tool with features for easy integration with other applications then we are making a directory for key rings and then this is where we are downloading um, the node version and then with the curl utility and then we are again updating everything and this is a command where you install the node.js let me run it so first it, it is going to install these libraries and then it will download this so let's wait for it to finish takes around one to two minutes as you can see it is running and downloading it so that's done now all we need to do is to check the node version node-v yeah, let me put exclamation mark here because it's a google colab there you go so we have now version 18 installed now if you want to uninstall the previously installed node.js then these are the commands which you need to use and so this is just a comment and then you just need to uncomment it and then it will use dpkg package to remove the node.js and the related libraries so this is it guys um, i hope that you enjoyed it if you still have any questions or confusion please drop them in the comments and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thank you